What's the crack, lads? I'm Paul Heron Manlyface, and welcome back to the park. Last time we finished off here, and there was a baby crying up here, so we're gonna go and see what the fuck is happening. Probably shit our pants afterwards. It's a matter of public record that I am a failure as a mother. Hey, the first wheel. Alan was very small. I left him asleep in the car while I ran an errand. Don't even remember what it was. When I came back, the sheriff was standing next to the car. Watching my boy through the window. I didn't like what I saw in his eyes. Judgment. Judgment. I take it without saying a word. Just the scratch, scratch of his pen on the notepad. When he gave it to me, our eyes met. I know what you're going through. My daughter, Helen, she just gets some help. Help was a bolt of lightning. Help was a thousand volts surging through my veins. Help is agony. I'd rather die. I wanted to scream. I'd rather you pulled your gun and shot me. But instead my mouth said, Yes, Sheriff. Yes, Sheriff. Okay, I don't don't gonna read that. Calm, where did you go? Calm. Calum, where did you go? Uh fuck. I don't want to walk the whole way up and down. Don't be afraid. Fuck lines. Oh, hey. No, it's fucking creepy baby crying crap. Don't like that. Where are you, Callum? Okay, decrease speed. Come on, decrease all the speed. Now, stop a route. Right, Ferris wheel. Awesome. There's probably a weird fucker in there again. I'm assuming. Ferris wheels are cool though. Look up so high and shit and just chill out. Wow. I like how there's no door and that's a very big fucking job though. Nope. No thank you, look out this side. People come into your life for a reason. Yeah. I used to say that before Mom ran off. After that, he mostly just drank. Things Yay. were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. He came in with some workers, but he didn't try to flirt or cop a feel like the others. He just ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. No, I and we're back. And laughed and eventually kissed. Oh yeah, she was like talking about him. Okay. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Calm was made that night or one of the ones that followed. I think it has to be that night. That one perfect night. That one perfect Mom night. And I moved in together, but then, well, he died. Oh According god. According to the supervisor, his safety harness failed when he was working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment. And then gone. Sometimes people leave your life for no reason. I was three oh, months shit. pregnant with Callum. Fairy tale fucking over. Yeah, it's it's kind of sad. Thank you for being my Ferris wheel man, uh, Mr. Top Hat Skeleton, whatever the fuck you are. What the fuck was that? Something came up there. Was it this again? I think it was that again. I am not going to do that again. Mommy is coming, Callum. Yes, Callum. Where are you, Callum? The baby is crying from down here. Yes, Callum. Oh, I actually have to go up here. Stay where you are. <sighs> God damn it. Okay. It sounds like the crying's coming from down here. So. Where are you, Callum? 
Adam. Don't be afraid. There is a real accident. What the fuck? Okay. Bye bye. Please, Callum, tell me where you are. Please, Callum. Callum. Yeah, Callum. Stop being a little shite. Where are you? Why do people idolize the children? They've been talking about their kids and just the way they talk. Their fucking voices make me want to vomit. My angel likes to read, and little Johnny is so good on the piano. Fuck those people! You spent nine months of your life carrying them. You traumatize yourself giving birth to them, and then you spend the rest of your life as their slave. Wiping asses, mopping a piss, feeding them, little life-sucking monsters who take and take and take until... <sighs> little shits. We all go insane. Any parent who pretends otherwise is just dishonest. That's called choice supportive bias. Yeah. I am honest. Callum really grinds my gears, and he owes me everything. Everything. It served the little fuck right if I just abandoned him. Yeah, little shit. I always wanted to write this one. Never got around to do it before. Oh, cause of Callum. Cause he's such a little shit. Where the fuck is the roller coaster? Oh, there it is. Cool. Yay! We don't give a shit about our son. What do you want? We need to talk about Callum. What the fuck? What do you mean? What have you done to him? I? That's insulting. You and your boy are everything that this place doesn't want. The antithesis of what we stand for. Where you have a weird Callum? fucking hand. The poor child. He tried so hard to do what he was taught. He even left you a trail of breadcrumbs. But the park is just so hungry. Tell me where my son is. The witch has him now. Has both of you. No happy ending Wyatt, here, I'm stop. afraid. Just... Just leave me alone. Let me alone. Oh, you always were. Okay. What the fuck? Okay. We. What the fuck is happening? Hey. Okay. I understand completely. Uh, apparently we're in a mental hospital. What the fuck? Not safe. I can taste your stuff. Dreams. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow, that was grim. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, child. Okay. Time to get off the roller coaster. That was fun and all, but... Bollocks of that. Let me off. Thank you. That was... Why am I on this side of it now? Okay. Um. I can help you, Callum. I can help you, Callum. 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 Flashlight. The witch awaits. How do I use the flashlight? I'm not playing anymore, Callum. This isn't a game, Callum! Callum has bruises on his arms, finger marks. Someone has been hurting him. I've asked him. Demanded really. Probably you. Where he got the marks. But he doesn't want to answer me. Probably Something you. You seem a bit insane. Silence. Doesn't dare talk. 
He's been changing too. Some How do I um? Something sinister lurks in the use darkness my, um, behind his flashlight. eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. But they are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. Okay. They're taking my baby away from me. Fuck them. I can't save him. And there will be pain. But I love him and in the end, he will understand why. Read the newspaper. The whole town was shocked by that one. Cotton candy corpse well, leaves sour taste in parkour's mouths. Behind the cotton candy stand, according to the local authorities, the corpse is yet to be identified. However, they have preferred that the remains appear to be those of a child. By a group of teenagers from Innsmouth Academy. Just outside behind a shack. I have a feeling it was you. What the fuck? Calla, where are you? Calla. Come back. Calla. Can I go out here? Um Callum? Callum I'm not playing anymore, Callum. There's something in there. Callum, where are you? There's something in there. What is it? Oh. It's the cotton candy area. Okay. Who did this to him? Oh, hello. Okay. Things are getting fucking weird again. I can help you, Callum. 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 Pills, take pills. The, these are mine. What the fuck are they? I didn't even get to read. Wow. Hello. Okay. Fucking fly guy. Wow. Fuck you. So I've got a certain way. Okay. Forgive me, Callum. Fucking. What the fuck? Oh. Fucking teddy bears. Oh. Fuck off. Don't touch me. Open. Oh, fuck you, so. Hello. You're all fucking creepy. Very fucking wiry. Dodgy times. Don't leave me here, Callum. Spoosh. I'm sorry. Callum. Dodgy times are happening. Oh. Oh, hello. Okay. <gasps> understanding. Much understanding. So we're insane and we're in an asylum by the looks of it. And we're taking our pills and we're tripping fucking major balls. I reckon the burnt corpse that the newspaper was 
on and out was my son. And for some magical reason, I am um, psychotic. Is this unlocked yet? Oh, it is. Awesome. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Oh, that was that was thrown away. Come back. Mommy, I'm scared. I want to be able. I want to be able to use my um, flashlight. I don't know what the uh, um don't know where. Okay. Callum, shut up, will you? is a collage of contradictions all of its own. Millions of people die every year in car crashes. And the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Yay. And the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass-produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard-earned five dollars. And what secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? The tears of jilted lovers, the soiled condoms of illicit affairs, the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. Okay. The, face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised her toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I'm assuming we're going in here. I think Callum is waiting for me inside. Can't see a fucking thing. This isn't a game. Fucking flies. Very, very dodgy times. Spooky. Sp spooky, scary witch. Yay, we're here now. Oh god. Oh the flashlight is on now. Yeah 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 yeah. I don't like it. You can go the fuck yourselves. Hello. Hello. Read page. Done. Atlantic Island Park's closed gates. A jeering throng of tr town folk. Gathers as we hung the heavy iron padlock on the gates. Small minded fools scared of what they don't understand. My machines lie silent and dejected, but I am not beaten. I have sent my wife and son back to Boston and I have retreated here to the house of horrors. I must think. Okay. Awesome. You're an evil looking bastard. Dodgy, dodgy, dodgy times. Okay. Oh, there's Callum. The little fuck. Okay. I'm going to leave this episode of the park here. And we can continue in the next episode. I think it's only about an hour and a half long. So it should only be the next episode that will be the ending. It seems like we're kind of getting towards the end of it now. After finding the whole witch's house and everything. So we'll see what happens in the next episode. But thank you all for watching this episode. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.